Good morning and happy Thanksgiving. It's real early Thursday morning. It's a, well, it just it's six o'clock. I got up about an hour ago, and I'm doing a smoked turkey today for Thanksgiving. Even though mom and my aunts, you know, they're they're cooking some other stuff anyway. I decided I'd go ahead and I wanted to smoke me a turkey today, and it's a traditional day for it. So that's what I'm up doing. I'm getting ready to get the the smoker going. And I've got a turkey in the refrigerator in here brining. It's uh, been brining for a day. So I'm going to pull it out, make up a rub, and uh, get it seasoned down. I'm going to use a salt and pepper rub on it. And I'm using the Aaron Franklin technique. I had his, that's his book right there. I'm just kind of going off of his, his technique. And he's also got a video on, on YouTube. So... You rub it down with some salt and pepper, and we're going to smoke it for a few hours, and then we're going to wrap it up with some butter on it, and let it finish cooking until about 165 or so, and hopefully we're going to have us a, a good tasty turkey at the end. So, thought I would bring you along and, and show you my turkey smoking adventure this morning. Alright, there's the turkey. Just uh, mixed up a brine, cooked it on the stove, and then poured it in cold water. And it looks like it's been doing good. So there's the rub, <clears throat> just some salt and pepper rub, and I'm going to generously apply it all over this turkey right here. And put some down on the inside. And we're going to take it out there and put it on the smoker. So we're using the smoke box here on the on the on the smoker. I've showed this one time before. That's that basket that we made up, and I've got it full of lump charcoal mixed in with a little bit of pecan, and I'll add more to that as it as it kind of burns in. And I'm just going to dump the uh, chimney of hot coals right on top of this. And that'll burn down. Get that kind of moved around a little bit. There's one down here. All right. And close that up. And as far as the smoker, I got to let it get hot now. And I've got a heat deflector that I built into it right here that I use for smoking. There's a pan there. There's water. I'll top it off. And then our turkey's gonna sit right in here. All right, we're gonna go ahead and put this turkey on. Everything's getting hot. You can hear everything over here sizzling, cooking in. All right, there we go. I'm going to top off my water pan while I'm here. Keep it, keep plenty of moisture going on in here. All right, we're going to let that cook a while. Smoke, should I say. And I got some, I got a few more little pieces of pecan I'm going to throw in here on top of the fire get some initial smoke rolling here so I'm using my eye grill and I got the two probes set up and what I've done is I've set one up on the breast and I got one in the thigh there and that'll just help me monitor the uh, the temperature as we get closer to our cook times All 
All right, so I've been cooking this turkey for really close to three hours. And on my eye grill, it's saying that we're at 165 on the thigh down here. And we're about 140 on the uh, breast side of it. Yeah, we're getting real close. So it's time to go ahead and wrap this thing up. 175 so we're show we're actually showing done on this one right here now this may be a little bit colder on that side yeah okay so what we're gonna do I am gonna take these pans I'm gonna pull those out And we're going to put it in here. Tilted it back just a little too far. All right, we're going to. We're going to put a pound of butter in this thing, on it, in it, wherever we can get it. This will help, since the turkey is doesn't have a lot of fat, this will kind of help add to the, the fat content and help it be a little more moist and tasty and and just good. So this will all melt down and, and hopefully just kind of baste and render into the turkey. Yeah, my lid won't work. That's why that's why I did the foil. The foil will actually kind of help hold some of that butter in and hopefully it'll kind of melt down. This is the first time I've tried it, but like I said, I watched Aaron do it and he says this is a good trick. So that's what we're gonna do. I wanna stick another piece of foil over that actually. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and put her on here. I'm going to put it on there and let her cook for another little while. And I'll come back in about an hour or so and we'll check the temps. Alright guys, this thing has been wrapped up for a good hour. Put the lid on it too, so I'm going to pull it off and I'm going to check temp. I bet you it's done. Steaming pretty good. I wanted to make sure that the, uh, the top of it here is cooked. Looks like we're there. It keeps going up. So yeah, we're well within our done range. Looks like close to 180 degrees. So what we'll do is let it rest. I'm gonna wrap it back up. I'm gonna let it rest for a half hour and then I'm gonna pull it all apart and we're going to take it over to mom's house and we're going to have some Thanksgiving dinner. All right. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and we're going to check this out. It's still hot. But it's been resting for a half hour. 
but I need to go ahead and get this uh, going and head over to mom's. So we're going to go ahead and open her up. And really what I want to do is like pull it apart and have a bunch of it in this container here so everybody can just kind of taste it or have some, you know, as they, as they want. But I'm not going to take the whole thing because mom's cooking a turkey and uh, my aunt's bringing a ham and there's going to be all kind of stuff. So I might pull apart like half the turkey and take it that way. It gives people a, a choice there. Very juicy. All right, juice just falling out of that turkey breast. Mmm. That's some good stuff. I like that. I can just see the moisture coming out of that. That's awesome. All right, well, I'm going to get this pulled apart and I'll see you in a little bit. <laughs> just got to mom's house she's over here cooking still and preparing some of the food you want to say hello to uh, the YouTube viewers hey YouTube viewers happy Thanksgiving <laughs> look at that she just unwrapped the dressing that's not stuffing that's dressing and there's the giblet gravy gravy okay and I'm fixing to roll dumplings oh this is gonna be for chicken and dumplings here and she's got turnips turnips and roots and Corn, corn, a lot of peas. Yep, and then here's uh, here's her turkey. And of course, I got mine that uh, I just brought. There it is, right there. And they said it's good. It's wonderful. Got deviled eggs. Oh, look at all the pies and stuff in there. <laughs> deviled eggs, two pumpkin pies, uh, coconut pie out in the refrigerator. Yeah. And there's an apple spice pound that you love, and a lemon pound cake over there. Yeah, look at these. Hey, Fernando. Hey, yeah. Say hello. Hello, YouTube viewers. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> All right. There's some more desserts there. And there's some uh, little pumpkin cakes over there. Yeah, look at that. Boy, she's just got stuff everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> That's what mamas do. It's Thanksgiving yeah. and Christmas. Yeah, this is the time she likes. She likes to cook. Love so. to. And bakes. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Well, it's still a little early. We got family coming over, and I'll probably get some of them on video too to say hello. All right, we got the cold drinks getting cold, and some Miller Lite, and I've got some Blue Moon. We're going to have a couple a couple drinks. There's Kevin. <laughs> we both wearing our Shop Life shirts. <laughs> but she's still never on time. Hey, say hey to YouTube. Hey, YouTube. Oh, wait, right here. here we go. This is my Adam. I love that baby. <laughs> this is ain't this ain't D. Yes, it is. His favorite aunt. Say hey y'all. Hey y'all. <laughs> I'm his favorite aunt. Uh huh. <laughs> so we're getting ready to eat. Just throw, uh, showing you the spread real quick of what we got. There's lots of food. Oh, they're gonna see it. Oh no. She said not to post that. <laughs> y'all gonna see it. I love you, but I don't want to be on TV. We're gonna TV. eat. <laughs> 